Hey you guys, hey you guys, it's your girl Kayla B. You know me, I'm coming at you with another video. This is another video. We have our boxy chart base box for February 2022. I can't believe it's 2022 already. Soon it will be 2024. And I will be getting a master's. Wow. I am old. I've been through a lot. <laughs> Anyways, let's get up into this unboxing. Boxy Charm is is it like twenty seven ninety nine? I believe. I believe that's the price. Because before it used to be twenty one, then it was twenty five, then with tax it would be twenty seven ninety eight. So now it's twenty seven ninety nine, and with tax it's like thirty something. For five full size products. You get five full size products. Makeup, skincare, life care, anything basically they put up in the box. It was supposed to be for your profile. You're supposed to do a profile. Um, do a little quiz, you know, say what you like, what you dislike, but you know, they never really follow it. Like Ipsy, they don't follow it. So before I go into the box, my ideal box is the OPV translucent setting powder, the little brush thing. Cause I I want I want to really try that out. I'm I'm just saying, I want to try that out. The pineapple lip scrub because obviously I need some lip scrubs in my life. My lips are uneven. Um, my choice item. I think that's that. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, the setting powder. I I mean the setting spray. I saw that it's a setting spray available when they put up all the stuff that you could get. I also want the setting spray. So let's see what I got. I mean, I know I didn't get one of them because I see a item that's not a setting powder. But let's get up into this, all right? Listen, I might not be all that. The theme is Be My uh, Glamantine. I have variation C22, 2022, 02, that's February, um, 020, so that's variation 20 BA. So I got variation 20. Cool. So let's just go with the first thing that I, I mean, it's a mask. So, yeah. This is the Tea Me Detox Mask Green Tea Blending Matcha Lemongrass Clay. I just got a whole bunch of clay masks. I got a whole clay mask in my Ipsy. And I got a whole clay mask in my Boxy Charm. I got a sample size in my Ipsy Glam bag. But that's usually all I need for a clay mask. And then I got this. Which I already have my Glam Glow. I mean, I'm glad to have full mask. Don't get me wrong. But I don't need this until the summer. Clay masks are my summer mask. So I won't be using this or opening up into the summer and when does it say it doesn't say it doesn't say the jar but the jar is usually six months it probably says it in the original packaging which is actually a box because it doesn't say it right here but yeah I got a detox mask let's see what the card says about it T T T me blends green tea doc detox mask. This mineral rich mask will be a must have in your self care routine. Made with organic matcha green tea, lemongrass, and clay. This natural detoxifying mask is formulated to rid pores of imp impurities while replenishing the skin with necessary superfood ingredients and nutrients. This retails for $29.99, so $30. That sounds about right. For a full mask that's not a sheet mask, that sounds about right. $30, yeah, mm-hmm. Clay mask. I mean, I love masks, don't get me wrong. It's just still winter time, and it's nowhere near summer yet, so I won't be using this. This is one of the products that I won't be using until summer, but I'm glad I don't have to buy a clay mask for the summer. That's, that's the thing about boxy. Sometimes they don't give you stuff that you would use in this time, but you would use later. So And you're just going to be glad that you don't have to buy the one, the product that you need later. That's all. 
the next thing is something that I actually am excited about. This is the Bali by um, Bomb Pineapple Lip Scrub. This Bali Bomb Pineapple Lip Scrub, this rich indulgent sugar scrub is packed with juicy pineapple fragrance and exfoliating sugar canes crystals to gently buff and polish away dead skin cells plus ultra smoothing blend of the finest botanicals the super hydrating coconut oil aromatic mess of cinnamon orange vanilla essential oils will leave your lips soft and supple this retails for 23 dollars 23 dollars not so bad i was gonna open it on camera but i didn't <gasps> the packaging it's like safari it's like a dark green oh it's forest green why does it say a dark green it's forest green it's like a safari it says 12 months after opening i'm opening it now mm. oh i smell pineapple it's like pineapple coconut it's like a freaking smoothie okay some of those oily lip balms i mean lip scrubs which i'm not mad about because it also hydrates your lips after scrubbing it I'm not mad about that. I am definitely putting this in my bathroom. I just finished my naked one. You guys know I love the naked lip scrubs. Oh. I love the naked lip scrubs. And if I want a really deep lip scrub, it's the Jeffree Star lip scrub. It's because you eat it. Where that, that's like a hard lip scrub. Like that's when my, my lips are need shaving. It needs that deep scrub. That deep exfoliation. Mm. Yeah. That feels so good. I'm just gonna keep on doing this for a minute. So, yeah. So I end up putting on lip gloss afterwards. So yeah, so you get a $30 mask, a $23 scrub. This is majority of the box, like right here. But to be honest, I really like this. This is the one I'm gonna immediately use. Yep, immediately use. Woo, next item. I always, I wanted to buy a setting spray, but I didn't want to buy a setting spray because I needed a new setting spray, hydrating setting spray, setting spray. And I got a new one to try. This is Ella Masqua. I love their eyeliners. That's one thing I could tell you. I love their eyeliners. I love their mascara. Um, would I repurchase it? Probably the Ellen Masca eyeliner, another mascara, because I have a lot of mascaras to try out. But yeah, anyways, the Hydra Setting Spray. This is the one I wanted to have in my box. I am so excited. I am literally excited about this. Okay. All right. It looks just like a regular setting spray, but I just can't wait to try it out. What did they say about this? This is give your makeup serious staying power even under extreme temperatures. Oh, Hydra Setting Spray is a lightweight mist that locks in makeup for a flawless skin look with a dewy finish. Oh, I like that. Non-sticky formula. Dries fast. Set your makeup all day. I like that. It's what I'm looking for in a setting spray. I hope this works. I hope this works. Again, another thing to be happy about. The only thing I'm iffy about is this because it's like a mask that we wear in the summer. I don't know if I'm going to actually keep it for summer or I'm just going to, you know, sell it on my Macari or Poshmark. By the way, Macari and Poshmark is down below in the description box. Let's keep on going. I hate this brand with the passion for eyeshadows. I hate this brand. This was last month's palette. What is last month's palette doing in my box? Especially when last month's palette that I got was also Wonder Beauty and it was not my tone, my skin tone friendly. <laughs> and I said when I reviewed it that I don't like Wonder Beauty. It gave me something else I don't like. Now I wish I had the powder. Like setting spray and setting powder would be a whoa. This is Wanda Beauty Escape, blah, blah, blah. 
It was just $42. I hate this brand. It just irritates my eyes. It's it's a personal, it's a me thing. Because a lot of people like this brand's formula. This brand's formula irritates my eyes. And the shadows doesn't stick right on my eyes. And it goes like crinkly. And it's just not smooth on my eyes. And I don't like that. That's my... That's, that's the one thing I don't like about eyeshadow, especially you have to use your fingers with this and usually I have nails. This time I don't have nails, but usually when I do have nails and I want to go to a Wander Beauty palette, when I did have Wander Beauty palettes, I couldn't do it. I don't like this brand. This will be on my Macari or Poshmark to sell. Look for it because I don't like it. Last product is my choice product which is from Ace Beauty. You know, I don't like their eyeshadows either. I don't like their eyeshadow formula either. But they're a black owned brand and it was between this or a eye cream and I just got an eye cream last month. So I was just like, no. Especially because I already have two backup eye creams so I don't need another backup eye cream, you know what I mean? Like I don't need it, I don't need it, I don't need it. But yeah, so. Ooh. I don't need the box. Well, I do need the box because it tells the ingredients, distributor, where to get it, www.acebeauty.com. It says 12 months, jar life. This, I don't think it's cruelty free because it doesn't have the bunny. But it says the glow essential highlighter palette is all you need. You need to get your glow on. Each shade is buildable and easily glides on the skin to give me a seamless glowing look. I love that. Wait, so I got a palette. I don't like it, but it's makeup. Got a setting spray. Love it. Makeup. Got this. Makeup. We got lip scrub. It's not makeup, but it's not also skincare. It's a. It's by itself. So basically, if you want to count it, two out of three skincare or one out of three skincare. I got a good box. I got an even box. Okay. Oh, I love it. I love it. It looks better than I did online. Oh, I could tell that this one has shifts of purple. And this one's just icy. I can mix it in with beaming to get like an icy gold peachy look. Look at that. That is beautiful. My finger went into popping by accident. That's a beautiful purple highlight, and I like purple highlights. Okay, yeah. I don't really like, I, I don't really use highlighter palettes that much. Because I still haven't used my Jeffree Star highlighted powder, and I was like salivating over that for like years. Like two years before I got it. But I like this. I like this and I will use it so I will use this I will use this I will definitely use this I just used it I'm only using it later on tonight and then I'll use this in the summer so four out of five is not that bad and that palette the Ace Beauty palette is $40 so I would do some math and tell you some math and I will tell you the total of the box so it retails for $160.99. This is supposed to be over $150, so it is over $150. But minus that palette, which is $42, it's $118.99. Minus what I paid for the box, which is $27.99. That's without the tax. I earned $91, so I saved $91. That's good. But that's it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. Video right here, video right here, hair right here. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to subscribe to BoxyCharm, link down below. Have a great day, y'all.